In chemical nomenclature, the IUPAC nomenclature of organic chemistry is a systematic method of naming organic chemical compounds as recommended by the International Union of Pure and Applied Chemistry It is published in the Nomenclature of Organic Chemistry informally called the Blue Book. Ideally, every possible organic compound should have a name from which an unambiguous structural formula can be created. There is also an IUPAC nomenclature of inorganic chemistry. To avoid long and tedious names in normal communication, the official IUPAC naming recommendations are not always followed in practice, except when it is necessary to give an unambiguous and absolute definition to a compound. IUPAC names can sometimes be simpler than older names, as with ethanol, instead of ethyl alcohol. For relatively simple molecules they can be more easily understood than non-systematic names, which must be learnt or looked up. However, the common or trivial name is often substantially shorter and clearer, and so preferred. These non-systematic names are often derived from an original source of the compound. In addition, very long names may be less clear than structural formulae. Topic. Basic principles In chemistry, a number of prefixes, suffixes and infixes are used to describe the type and position of functional groups in the compound. The steps for naming an organic compound are Identification of the parent hydrocarbon chain. This chain must obey the following rules, in order of precedence. It should have the maximum number of substituents of the suffix functional group. By suffix, it is meant that the parent functional group should have a suffix, unlike halogen substituents. If more than one functional group is present, the one with highest precedence should be used. It should have the maximum number of multiple bonds. It should have the maximum number of single bonds. It should have the maximum length. Identification of the parent functional group, if any, with the highest order of precedence. Identification of the side chains. Side chains are the carbon chains that are not in the parent chain, but are branched off from it. Identification of the remaining functional groups, if any, and naming them by their ionic prefixes such as hydroxy for O, oxy for equals O, oxyalkane for OR, etc. Different side chains and functional groups will be grouped together in alphabetical order. The prefixes D, tri, etc. are not taken into consideration for grouping alphabetically. For example, ethyl comes before dihydroxy or dimethyl, as the E in ethyl precedes the H in dihydroxy and the M in dimethyl alphabetically. The D is not considered in either case. When both side chains and secondary functional groups are present, they should be written mixed together in one group rather than in two separate groups. Identification of double, triple bonds. Numbering of the chain. This is done by first numbering the chain in both directions left to right and right to left, and then choosing the numbering which follows these rules, in order of precedence, has the lowest numbered locant or locants for the suffix functional group. Locants are the numbers on the carbons to which the substituent is directly attached. Has the lowest numbered locants for multiple bonds the locant of a multiple bond is the number of the adjacent carbon with a lower number has the lowest numbered locants for prefixes. Numbering of the various substituents and bonds with their locants. If there is more than one of the same type of substituent, double bond, a prefix is added showing how many there are d2 tri 3 tetra 4 then as for the number of carbons below with a added the numbers for that type of side chain will be grouped in ascending order and written before the name of the side chain. If there are two side chains with the same alpha carbon, the number will be written twice. Example, 2, 2, 3 trimethyl. If there are both double bonds and triple bonds, and double bond is written before yne triple bond. When the main functional group is a terminal functional group a group which can exist only at the end of a chain, like formal and carboxyl groups, there is no need to number it. Arrangement in this form, group of side chains and secondary functional groups with numbers made in step 3 plus prefix of parent hydrocarbon chain eth, meth, plus double, triple bonds with numbers or an plus primary functional group suffix with numbers, wherever it says with numbers, it is understood that between the word and the numbers, the prefix d, tri, is used. 
Adding of punctuation, commas are put between numbers 255 becomes 2, 5, 5 hyphens are put between a number and a letter 255 trimethylheptane becomes 2, 5, 5 trimethylheptane successive words are merged into one word trimethylheptane becomes trimethylheptane note, IUPAC uses one word names throughout. This is why all parts are connected. The finalized name should look like this: hash hash d hash 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 try an greater than hash hash d hash hash note hash is used for a number. The group secondary functional groups and side chains may not look the same as shown here, as the side chains and secondary functional groups are arranged alphabetically. The d and try have been used just to show their usage, d after hash, hash, try after hash, 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 etc. Example here is a sample molecule with the parent carbons numbered. For simplicity, here is an image of the same molecule, where the hydrogens in the parent chain are removed and the carbons are shown by their numbers. Now, following the above steps, the parent hydrocarbon chain has 23 carbons. It is called trichosa. The functional groups with the highest precedence are the two ketone groups. The groups are on carbon atoms 3 and 9. As there are 2, we write 3, 9 dione. The numbering of the molecule is based on the ketone groups. When numbering from left to right, the ketone groups are numbered 3 and 9. When numbering from right to left, the ketone groups are numbered 15 and 21. 3 is less than 15, therefore the ketones are numbered 3 and 9. The smaller number is always used, not the sum of the constituents numbers. The side chains are, an ethyl at carbon 4, an ethyl at carbon 8, and a butyl at carbon 12. Note, the OCH3 at carbon atom 15 is not a side chain, but it is a methoxy functional group. There are two ethyl groups. They are combined to create, 4, 8 diethyl. The side chains are grouped like this, 12 butyl 4, 8 diethyl, but this is not necessarily the final grouping, as functional groups may be added in between to ensure all groups are listed alphabetically. The secondary functional groups are, a hydroxy at carbon 5, a chloro at carbon 11, a methoxy at carbon 15, and a bromo at carbon 18. Grouped with the side chains, this gives 18 bromo 12 butyl 11 chloro 4, 8 diethyl 5 hydroxy 15 methoxy. There are two double bonds, one between carbons 6 and 7, and one between carbons 13 and 14. They would be called 6, 13 dean, but the presence of alkynes switches it to 6, 13 dean. There is one triple bond between carbon atoms 19 and 20. It will be called 19 yne. The arrangement with punctuation is 18 bromo 12 butyl 11 chloro 4 8 diethyl 5 hydroxy 15 methoxytricosa 6 13 dean 19 yne 3 9 dione finally due to cis trans isomerism we have to specify the relative orientation of functional groups around each double bond for this example, we have 6e, 13e, the final name is 6e, 13e, minus 18 bromo 12 butyl 11 chloro 4, 8 diethyl 5 hydroxy 15 methoxytricosa 6, 13 dean 19 yne 3, 9 dione. <laughs> Alkanes Straight chain alkanes take the suffix an and are prefixed depending on the number of carbon atoms in the chain, following standard rules. The first few are For example, the simplest alkane is CH4 methane, and the 9 carbon alkane CH3 CH2 7 CH3 is named nonane. The names of the first four alkanes were derived from methanol, ether, propionic acid, and butyric acid, respectively. The rest are named with a Greek numeric prefix, with the exceptions of nonane which has a Latin prefix, and undecane and tridecane which have mixed language prefixes. Cyclic alkanes are simply prefixed with cyclo. For example, C4H8 is cyclobutane, not to be confused with butene, and C6H12 is cyclohexane, not to be confused with hexene. Branched alkanes are named as a straight chain alkane with attached alkyl groups. They are prefixed with a number indicating the carbon the group is attached to, counting from the end of the alkane chain. For example, CH3 2 -CH -CH3, commonly known as isobutane, is treated as a propane chain with a methyl group bonded to the middle carbon, and given the systematic name 2-methylpropane. However, although the name 2-methylpropane could be used, it is easier and more logical to call it simply methylpropane. The methyl group could not possibly occur on any of the other carbon atoms that would lengthen the chain and result in butane, not propane, and therefore the use of the number 
to is unnecessary. If there is ambiguity in the position of the substituent, depending on which end of the alkane chain is counted as 1, then numbering is chosen so that the smaller number is used. For example, CH3 2 CH CH2 CH3 isopentane is named 2-methylbutane, not 3-methylbutane. If there are multiple side branches of the same size alkyl group, their positions are separated by commas and the group prefixed with D, tri, tetra, etc., depending on the number of branches. For example, C CH3 4 neopentane is named 2, 2-dimethylpropane. 2 if there are different groups, they are added in alphabetical order, separated by commas or hyphens. The longest possible main alkane chain is used, therefore 3-ethyl-4-methylhexane instead of 2,3-diethylpentane, even though these describe equivalent structures. The D, tri etc. prefixes are ignored for the purpose of alphabetical ordering of side chains e.g. 3-ethyl-2,4-dimethylpentane, not 2,4-dimethyl-3-ethylpentane. Alkenes and alkynes Alkenes are named for their parent alkane chain with the suffix ene and an infixed number indicating the position of the carbon with the lower number for each double bond in the chain, CH2 equals CHCH2CH3 as but one ene. Multiple double bonds take the form dene, triene, etc., with the size prefix of the chain taking an extra a. CH2 equals CHCH equals CH2 as Buddha 1, 3 dene. Simple cis and trans isomers may be indicated with a prefixed cis or trans, cis but 2 ene, trans but 2 ene. However, cis and trans are relative descriptors. It is IUPAC convention to describe all alkenes using absolute descriptors of Z same side and E opposite with the can Ingold prelog priority rules. Alkynes are named using the same system, with the suffix. Yne, indicating a triple bond, ethyne acetylene, propyne methylacetylene. Topic: <laughs> Functional groups. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Alcohols. Alcohols RO take the suffix ol. With an infix numerical bonding position, CH3CH2CH2OH is propan1OL. The suffixes diol, triol, tetraol, etc., are used for multiple O groups. Ethylene glycol CH2OHCH2OH is ethane 1, 2 diol. If higher precedence functional groups are present, see order of precedence, below, the prefix hydroxy is used with the bonding position, CH3CHOHCOOH is 2-hydroxypropanoic acid. Halogens alkyl halides. Halogen functional groups are prefixed with the bonding position and take the form of fluoro, chloro, bromo, iodo, etc., depending on the halogen. Multiple groups are dichloro, trichloro, etc., and dissimilar groups are ordered alphabetically as before. For example, CHCl3 chloroform is trichloromethane. The anesthetic halothane CF3 CHBrCl is 2 bromo 2 chloro 1, 1, 1 trifluoroethane. <laughs> Ketones In general ketones RCOR take the suffix 1 pronounced own not 1 with an infix position number CH3CH2CH2COCH3 is pentan 2 1 If a higher precedence suffix is in use the prefix oxo is used CH3CH2CH2COCH2CHO is 3 oxohexanol topic Aldehydes Aldehydes Archo take the suffix al. If other functional groups are present, the chain is numbered such that the aldehyde carbon is in the 1 position, unless functional groups of higher precedence are present. If a prefix form is required, oxo is used as for ketones, with the position number indicating the end of a chain, CHOCH2COOH is 3-oxypropanoic acid. 
If the carbon in the carbonyl group cannot be included in the attached chain for instance in the case of cyclic aldehydes, the prefix formal or the suffix carbaldehyde is used, C6H11CHO is cyclohexanecarbaldehyde. If an aldehyde is attached to a benzene and is the main functional group, the suffix becomes benzaldehyde. Topic: <laughs> Carboxylic acids. In general, carboxylic acids are named with the suffix oic acid, etymologically a back formation from benzoic acid. Similar to aldehydes, they take the one. Position on the parent chain, but do not have their position number indicated. For example, CH3CH2CH2CH2COOH valeric acid is named pentanoic acid. For common carboxylic acids, some traditional names such as acetic acid are in such widespread use they are considered retained IUPAC names, although systematic names such as ethanoic acid are also acceptable. For carboxylic acids attached to a benzene ring such as PHCOOH, these are named as benzoic acid or its derivatives. If there are multiple carboxyl groups on the same parent chain, the suffix carboxylic acid can be used as dicarboxylic acid, tricarboxylic acid, etc. In these cases, the carbon in the carboxyl group does not count as being part of the main alkane chain. The same is true for the prefix form carboxyl. Citric acid is one example, it is named 2-hydroxypropane 1, 2, 3-tricarboxylic acid, rather than 3-carboxy-3-hydroxypentanedioic acid. Ethers Ethers consist of an oxygen atom between the two attached carbon chains. The shorter of the two chains becomes the first part of the name with the an suffix changed to oxy, and the longer alkane chain becomes the suffix of the name of the ether. Thus, CH3OCH3 is methoxymethane, and CH3OCH2CH3 is methoxyethane, not ethoxymethane. If the oxygen is not attached to the end of the main alkane chain, then the whole shorter alkyl plus ether group is treated as a side chain and prefixed with its bonding position on the main chain. Thus CH3OCH CH3 2 is 2-methoxypropane. Alternatively, an ether chain can be named as an alkane in which one carbon is replaced by an oxygen, a replacement denoted by the prefix oxa. For example, CH3OCH2CH3 could also be called 2-oxybutane, and an epoxide could be called oxycyclopropane. This method is especially useful when both groups attached to the oxygen atom are complex. Topic. Esters Esters are named as alkyl derivatives of carboxylic acids. The alkyl R group is named first. The RCOO part is then named as a separate word based on the carboxylic acid name, with the ending changed from OIC acid to OAT. For example, CH3CH2CH2CH2COOCH3 is methyl pentanoate, and CH3-2CHCH2CH2COOCH2CH3 is ethyl 4 methyl pentanoate. For esters such as ethyl acetate, CH3COOCH2CH3, ethyl formate, HCOOCH2CH3, or dimethyl phthalate that are based on common acids, IUPAC recommends use of these established names, called retained names. The OAT changes to 8. Some simple examples, named both ways, are shown in the figure above. If the alkyl group is not attached at the end of the chain, the bond position to the ester group is infixed before. YL. CH3 CH2 CH CH3 OOC CH2 CH3 may be called but 2 YL propanoate or but 2 YL propionate. Topic: <laughs> Amines and amides. Amines RNH2 are named for the attached alkane chain with the suffix amine, e.g. CH3 NH2 methanamine. If necessary, the bonding position is infixed, CH3CH2CH2NH2-propan-1-amine, CH3CHNH2CH3-propan-2-amine. The prefix form is amino. 
For secondary amines of the form RNHR, the longest carbon chain attached to the nitrogen atom becomes the primary name of the amine. The other chain is prefixed as an alkyl group with location prefix given as an italic N, CH3 NH CH2 CH3 as N methylethanamine. Tertiary amines RNRR are treated similarly, CH3 CH2 N CH3 CH2 CH2 CH3 as N ethyl N methylpropanamine. Again, the substituent groups are ordered alphabetically. Amides RCONH2 take the suffix amide or carboxamide if the carbon in the amide group cannot be included in the main chain. The prefix form is both carbamoyl and amido. Amides that have additional substituents on the nitrogen are treated similarly to the case of amines, they are ordered alphabetically with the location prefix N, HCON, CH3, 2 is N, N dimethylmethanamide. Cyclic compounds Cycloalkanes and aromatic compounds can be treated as the main parent chain of the compound, in which case the positions of substituents are numbered around the ring structure. For example, the three isomers of xylene CH3C6H4CH3, commonly the ortho, meta, and para forms, are 1,2-dimethylbenzene, 1,3-dimethylbenzene, and 1,4-dimethylbenzene. The cyclic structures can also be treated as functional groups themselves, in which case they take the prefix cycloalkyl, e.g. cyclohexyl, or for benzene, phenyl. The IUPAC nomenclature scheme becomes rapidly more elaborate for more complex cyclic structures, with notation for compounds containing conjoined rings, and many common names such as phenol being accepted as base names for compounds derived from them. Spiro compounds. Topic: Bicyclic compounds. Topic: Polycyclic compounds. See cycloalkane hashtag nomenclature, bicyclic molecule hashtag nomenclature. Topic: Order of precedence of groups. When compounds contain more than one functional group, the order of precedence determines which groups are named with prefix or suffix forms. The highest precedence group takes the suffix, with all others taking the prefix form. However, double and triple bonds only take suffix form N and, YN and are used with other suffixes. Prefixed substituents are ordered alphabetically excluding any modifiers such as D, tri, etc., e.g. chlorofluoromethane, not fluorochloromethane. If there are multiple functional groups of the same type, either prefixed or suffixed, the position numbers are ordered numerically thus ethane 1, 2 diol, not ethane 2, 1 diol. The end position indicator for amines and amides comes before 1, e.g. CH3 CH, CH3, CH2 NH, CH3, is N, 2 dimethylpropanamine. Asterisk note, these suffixes, in which the carbon atom is counted as part of the preceding chain, are the most commonly used. See individual functional group articles for more details. The order of remaining functional groups is only needed for substituted benzene and hence is not mentioned here. Topic: <laughs> Common nomenclature, trivial names. Common nomenclature uses the older names for some organic compounds instead of using the prefixes for the carbon skeleton above. The pattern can be seen below. Topic: Ketones. Common names for ketones can be derived by naming the two alkyl or aryl groups bonded to the carbonyl group as separate words followed by the word ketone. Acetone, acetophenone, benzophenone, ethyl isopropyl ketone. Diethyl ketone. The first three of the names shown above are still considered to be acceptable IUPAC names. Topic: <inaudible> Aldehydes. 
The common name for an aldehyde is derived from the common name of the corresponding carboxylic acid by dropping the word acid and changing the suffix from IC or OIC to aldehyde. Formaldehyde Acetaldehyde Ions <inaudible> 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 The IUPAC nomenclature also provides rules for naming ions. Topic: <inaudible> Hydrin. Hydrin is a generic term for hydrogen cation. Protons, deuterons and tritons are all hydrons. The hydrons are not found in heavier isotopes, however. Topic: Parent hydride cations Simple cations formed by adding a hydron to a hydride of a halogen, chalcogen or nictogen are named by adding the suffix «onium» to the element's root, H4N plus is ammonium, H3O plus is oxonium, and H2F plus is fluoronium. Ammonium was adopted instead of nitronium, which commonly refers to NO2 plus. If the cationic center of the hydride is not a halogen, chalcogen or nictogen then the suffix IUM is added to the name of the neutral hydride after dropping any final e. H5C plus is methanium, HO o plus H2 is dioxidanium, HO o is dioxidane, and H2N N plus H3 is diazanium, H2N N H2 is diazane. Cations and substitution The above cations except for methanium are not, strictly speaking, organic, since they do not contain carbon. However, many organic cations are obtained by substituting another element or some functional group for a hydrogen. The name of each substitution is prefixed to the hydride cation name. If many substitutions by the same functional group occur, then the number is indicated by prefixing with D. Tri. As with halogenation, CH3 3O plus is trimethyloxonium. CH3 F3N plus is trifluoromethylammonium. Topic. See also. Hans Widman nomenclature. International Union of Biochemistry and Molecular Biology. Nucleic acid notation. Organic nomenclature in Chinese Fanes Preferred IUPAC name Von Bayer nomenclature